All right, up next, Lair of the Bug King. What do we got here? We got a, a cutscene? Let's watch a cutscene. What's going on in Nature Park? Oh, yep, that's all the people we know. Plus, Ribbon Lady, I guess. Are we ever gonna figure out who the hell that is? Why does she wear so many ribbons? What is her dark origin story? Oh, that's a golden bug. You gotta avoid those golden scarabs, they fuck you up. You don't wanna touch scarabs, I've seen- I've seen mummy. You don't- it's bad, they crawl under your skin and they eat your insides. Oh, well I guess he's dead forever. Is- I think this is the, how the game Limbo starts. Oh my god, oh my god! This is a problem! The legendary bug kings of great appetite and little patience. Banish them to the ether by bouncing glow bugs into them. That makes total sense. Excuse me? What the fuck? Order matters. Okay. Do I just put them in the three slots, I guess? Okay. I guess I have it figured out. This game is... This game keeps getting weirder. We're just making up new mechanics in every video, aren't we? The Kings were last sighted in 86 buying t-shirts at an Eddie Money concert. Okay, so this is interesting. So I want to bounce it. Will that hit... It will hit someone. Cool. Let's double bounce them. Bam! Look at me nailing it. Even though I hit one of them on accident. That's just how pro I am, apparently. This is... This is getting into auditorium territory now. Interesting. Ben would like not to be eaten to death, or similar, before his date with June tonight. Yes, I would, I would also like to not be eaten to death. I think that's an excellent strategy in life. What am I going to do here? Just put another one here, and then put a deflection here. Hey, this is easy. Look at me. Look at me being all boss and badass and shit. Got all this figured out. You can't stop this. You can't stop me. Look at that bag of happen filling right up. Good thing the kings live in a cave of selectively ex... So what is this? Of selectively explosive <laughs> bouncing glow bugs. Oh, well. That's not even... What happened there? That seemed glitchy. Like it bounced at the wrong time or something. Oh! Bounce you back. Oh my god, what have I done? I'm so sorry. Okay, let's try this again. Can I bounce it uh, that way? Oh, there we go. Okay, now I know what to do. So you start here. Then put one here. Oh! They're bouncing off each other. Then put one here. And it'll bounce... ...up towards the other king. There we go! Figured that shit out right fast. I'm good at this whole angular momentum... ...math... ...trigonometry... Th blah, 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 ...thing. Oh, cool! I beat the whole level. That was easy. What the fuck's gonna happen next in this game? I thought this was a game where you choose where to seat robots and girls. <laughs> now we're fighting ro robot golden mecha Tarzan bug kings. What? What did I say? Yeah, I'd be dizzy too if I just got thrown straight up like 40 feet out of a cave. No one seems to be concerned that every girl in this class except for one looks exactly the same. Now what's gonna happen? Oh! Excuse me? Excuse me? We're just gonna... D this is just what we're doing now? We're just gonna... <laughs> now they're just getting killed by volcanic rocks? Like... Oh, they're over it, I guess. I thought that I was seating people for a school dance. Suddenly we're dealing with horrifying volcanic... Aww. That poor third girl, no one cares that she died. What are they gonna do, sacrifice her? What's happening? Oh my god, they vibrated and a picnic came out. <laughs> is that how babies work? Pie is so good that a girl could forget about all the her, her problems. So you put pie? <gasps> girds and girds, oh my god. Girls and nerds are always happily seated next to pie. 
Robots are capable of love, but cannot comprehend the infinities of Pi. <laughs> this is their greatest tragedy. <laughs> Dear Lord. Pie first, other foods later. Or maybe just more pie. Oh. So let's let's surround Oh crap, it's one of those you you get the you get the you have to do them in this order thing. Let's do yeah, robot. I, I wanna put uh I wanna put girls next to the pie because then they'll just stay happy and I don't have to deal with their bullshit anymore. Oh, another pie already? I didn't even get to figure out good things. Let's put it down. Let's put it over here. And put the nerd next to the girl so that he's happy. Got to put robot next to girl to make them get along, but avoid the pie. More, more nerd, more nerd pie. More nerd pie must happen. Uh, I, I don't know why I said nerd pie. It's a girl pie. The girl is by the pie. Nerds, nerds, nerds must be next to girls. Yes. Let's put them in the corner. Let's have more happy girls. Happy girls be happy. All up in this business. Seems to be going really well, actually. I'm happy with this. I'm gonna put, a, I'm gonna put the last girl on that left side, I think. Hey, there, there she is. Everyone's pretty good. So, everyone's happy so far. Good for me. I have mastered this shit. Uh, corner. Put the nerds in the corner. They're happy. Ah, oh, shit. I messed up. There was one mildly disappointed robot, but that's okay. They don't have they don't have feelings. We can just program them to be happier in the future. They don't need to be bad girls. They're not they're not even real people. We took a vote. Pi is one. That was a very good vote. I agree with this vote. She continued to have more votes like it. Let's have more corner to geeks. Come on, geek, you're on the edge. Why aren't you happy? Oh, you don't like being next to Pi. Right. Robot. Let's do girls by the robot. There we go. <gasps> More pie. Whatever I'm gonna put. Let's put the pie out as far away from the other pie as possible for, for maximum pie effectiveness. Uh, son of a bitch, what am I gonna do? <laughs> two geek, geek girls, yes, because then they get happy by the geek girls. Edge geek. Super happy edge geek. Uh, da 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 da. -da. Even you gotta keep those robots away from the pies, or they're not going to be very happy because they have they have emotional distress problems. I'm sorry. I definitely want to put in as many. I'm trying to put as many girls around the pie specifically as I can, because then nothing can ever make them unhappy. And that's my goal in life: to make all the girls happy. Let's do geeks next to the happy girls, because they're infinitely happy in that situation. Let's do robot next to the girl to make him happy. This is working out very well so far. Geek next to the infinitely happy girl. Uh, da -da -da. Geek by the other girl. We need to do robot girl. Uh, I neglected the robots again, didn't I? There's gonna be bummed out robots everywhere. I failed. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Shit. Ah, uh, I'll just start over. I don't know how to. I don't know how to make this work better without just starting over. This shit gets difficult when you have to, uh, carefully figure out how to space things out. What is it? When, when they make it so you have to start from scratch and just start placing things next to each other. Because then you're like, I don't, I can't figure this out. I don't know where to go. Alright, so I, I think I over-distributed my, uh, I put too many... Nope. Robot does not like geek. I need, to be, I need to be more careful about my robots because there's a there's a shit ton of robots. They're they're usually a sort of a scarcity in this game, but in, in this specific level, they give me so many that I actually I underutilize them, and then they are left alone to be unhappy and lonesome and dead inside and things like that. It's really unfortunate. Am I gonna have enough? I need to put these in places so that I will have enough robots for them. I'm just gonna smother this woman in, in robots. That's what's gonna happen here. And put another one up here. So... Geek next to the girl. Geek next to girl. Geek... Nope, oh, robot. Let's make this girl happy. Nope! No, 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 no. Sorry, did not notice it was changing characters on me. Fucking with me. Oh, she doesn't like that. Shit. Is that working out? It's not working out. Oh, I... No. 
Where can I put this woman? Oh, there we go. There we go. This girl's next to Pi and we'll be happy forever. If she likes it or not. Uh, <laughs> uh, robot next to girl. Robot next to girl. Robot next to girl. Hey, this is working. Aww. I fucked up again. I still have too many robots. And this robot doesn't like pie. Well, whatever. Fuck it. I want it. At least I won. Let's move forward. <laughs> Play this game yourself and do better than me. I encourage you. And things. I encourage you to be successful in life. I believe in you. Maybe. Look at the happy girl and a robot. We're back to the girl and a robot. Let's just casually forget about the horrifyingly weird fucking bug king shit that happened a second ago. What is the... Is the quilt on fire? Nobody wants to sit on a flaming hole in the blanket. Wait, am I clicking there? Really? Did we really need a tutorial for that? That's what I was thinking. She's... Why isn't she on fire? <laughs> she should be dead, right? Also, sitting on fire takes the fun out of eating pie. Sitting in fire is pretty much the worst. Thanks, tutorial. I would have never figured that out on my own. A little blanket fire is nothing to worry about. What happens if I put the pie there? Does the pie fix everything? Does it make everyone happy? What's the robot do? Oh, robot doesn't like robot doesn't like fire either. What if I put the nerd there and surround him with girls? Does that make the nerd happy? It does not make the nerd happy. So someone's gonna be unhappy today, and they're just gonna have to deal with those sort of emotional problems, because I can't deal with their bullshit today. Let's do nerds next to the girls to make them happy. Good job, nerds. Be happy. Ah. Oh. But now the fi now the now the robots are gonna be disappointed. Oh wait. Who's gonna be angry today? Let's see. Let's do robot. Robot. Nerd will be happy in the corner. Yay! Everyone's perfectly happy, and then this nerd catches on fire. Sorry, nerd. You're just gonna have to be- you're gonna have to deal with the fact that your fucking thing's on fire. Maybe you guys should move to, like, anywhere else for this picnic. Like a different blanket. Or... the dirt, which doesn't burn. That seems like a better strategy. Seriously, this is a personal problem. Most picnic blankets have multiple burning spots, right? No. No, they do not. This is not normal behavior for a blanket. This is abnormal, I would even say. Uh, let's do a pie over here. Don't worry, be happy, right? Please be happy, guys. Please don't all die. Ah. Put the nerd next to the infinitely happy girl because she has pie! And put another girl by the pie so that I can continue to farm nerds all over her. That's a really disturbing way of describing that, isn't it? I don't care. I'm just, I'm not a good person. Uh, Girl, where are you going? Where do I put you, girl? I'll put you here. There you go. You're gonna be angry anyway, but now I can use I can make use you to make nerds happy. So good for you. Shit, I'm doing it again. Ah, uh, making robots unhappy again. It's not giving me any robots. It's making me plan ahead. Shit, I have to use my brain thinky powers. That's annoying. I'm not good at those. Do nerd on the edge? Hey, you guys are happy for some reason. Good for you. Uh, nerd, where are you gonna go? Nerd, where am I gonna put you? Guess I'm just gonna surround you with girls. You just gonna have to deal with that problem. Enjoy, because I need I need the robots to be happy next to the girls. Where am I gonna put this girl? Where am I gonna put this girl? Is she just gonna be on fire? I guess, because just I don't even know. She's gonna be on fire. Deal with it. There you go. Robots make everyone happy. Even girls that are on fire, right? Success! I won! Congratulations, me! I love me! I'm so proud of myself. Good job. Squeaking by. Just like in real life. <laughs> fire. Fire and pie would make a good band name. I'm not sure if that's true. Oh my god, there's 11 women. Let's surround them with nerds. Oh, that's a pie. Shit. <laughs> They give me so little control of when I'm going to do things. Uh, this, let's burn the pie. Burn all the pies, and then you have infinitely happy nerds everywhere. Good for me. So many nerds just all over this all these women. I'm sorry, women. I, I should put that nerd somewhere else. Shit. Shit. Uh, what if I catch him on fire? Uh, <laughs> it's so hard to plan this shit. Someone's going to have to sit on that fire at some point. I'm just going to put that nerd here. He's just going to have to deal. Sorry, nerd. She's gonna have to deal with your emotional problems for a while. Surround this robot with, with girls, make him happy, everybody's happy, good for you. And then another pie. 
preferably on a fire. They give me almost enough pies to cover every fire, but not quite, which is unfortunate. Put the girl here so the pie goes and makes her happy. There we go. Do some nerd, nerd pies. Is that a thing? I don't care. Maybe it's a thing, maybe it's not a thing. Maybe you should stop questioning my motives in life. Everyone's happy so far, right? Except for Flaming Nerd? That's, that sounds offensive. I don't mean to say that he's homosexual, I just mean that he's on, he's on fire. It's, it's a problem. His family's tried to reach out to him, but he just can't seem to get his shit together. Uh, Flaming Nerd that's angry. Don't worry, I'll put a pie here. It won't help you, but it'll help the girl that you're sitting next to. So, you know, be happy for her. <laughs> uh, so many girls, so little space. Jesus, they're just making me place all the girls. Nerd, so many robots make everyone happy. There we go. Everyone's happy still, except for nerd that has that has distraught, distress problems. But you know, the more the merrier, or whatever. Oh, why is oh he can't can't put the robot next to the pie. The next to the pie, next to the <laughs> I'm an idiot. Can't put the robot next. To, oh my God, so many robots are together and they're all happy. They're gonna create the ultimate robot race. They're gonna take over the galaxy. I'm so scared. Uh -huh. If, I, if they continue to spread unchecked in this fashion, then they're going to create Cybernet. Burn, women! Burn! 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 Ha ha ha! You're all on fire. Oh, I didn't reach a gold. I didn't reach for- Oh, I only got 41 out of 47. I thought I was doing really well. Everyone seemed really happy, except for the people that were on fire, but... What am I gonna do about them? There's fires, and I can't get rid of them. Well... I'm sorry. I didn't mean to make everyone unhappy, but... Things happen. Anyway, 